I've got my hands on this Kate figure from Lost. I actually own several of these, but they're on display in my house, still in the box. I never wanted to open them. But I recently came across this Kate figure at a Goodwill for $8.99, and I just had to take it so that I can actually open it up and set it up. Now, if you've never seen these, they're very, very cool. There's several series of them, each with different figures from the main cast. But this is your season one with Locke, Kate, Jack, Shannon, The Hatch, Hurley, and Charlie. Very, very cool. They have uh, very detailed rep replications of things in the show, such as the airplane. And she even says voice clips from the show. So let's open it up and take a look. I've always wanted to open them up, but I never have for fear of ruining them or getting them dirty. And now that I have a duplicate, I can actually open her up. Her box is super reflective, so it'll be really nice to open it and get a better look. It's glued in real tight. Slide her out. Very nice. Oh, the plane has already crashed. So there's the plane. I noticed the plane is missing a prop. I don't know if in the show, the plane was actually missing the prop. Let's look on the box, yes. The box does show the plane is missing a prop. So that's really cool, some detail there. Let's get this bamboo out. Oh, there's a lot of it. There's her stand. Some more stuff. This is uh this here is a sound box. And let's get her out. She is held in place by what looks to be a twisty tie. Boy is she starting to happen. Get her out. There she is. She's out. Push her back. She will go like this. There's little pegs under. So her pegs barely fit her feet. It was almost impossible to get them on these pegs. But there she is. And now we've got all these little bamboo pieces that we've got a gem on there. I guess it's kind of like a puzzle. I'm going to figure out which one goes into which slot. The bottoms have a special shape so you can figure it out with, I guess, a little bit of Guesswork. I've actually gone two for two. I should play Survivor. I'd do good. Yeah. So now we're creating her little bamboo. It's a little more involved than I thought it was. All right, so there she is. One thing I learned is she does not look exactly the same as on the box. So now we're supposed to build the backdrop, but as much as I hate to say it, I believe it's missing components. All right, we're gonna pop this battery compartment off and put two AAA batteries in and listen to her uh, various authentic sound clips. If you wanna know the screwdriver kit I'm using, check the link in my description below. It's awesome and it's cheap. As a whole bunch of random tips you can change to fix everything from Sega and Sony machines to your phones and toys. Now this just plugs into the back here. So there she is, minus the black backdrop. I guess I could cut a piece of black cardboard and insert it in there, so I'll probably do that. Maybe I'll even print something on a five by seven, like some woods or jungle or whatever. But for now, that's her. She's pretty cool, she looks decent. And uh, it's a fun little scene from Lost. But 
She's supposed to have authentic sounds. Let's press this box and see what it does. Torturing him didn't work. Well, there they are. So there she is. The only thing remains is this plane. In season one, episode 12, whatever the case may be, uh, Kate fights with Sawyer and lies to Jack to retrieve a toy plane, a reminder of her past. This prop is apparently a full-scale replica of the miniature plane as it appears in the show. So that's interesting. I don't know how it fits with this jungle scene, but we could stick it right there. And you have a pretty cool little piece of lost toy history. I'm going to add it to my collection, and I like it. In case you want to see, Kate set up <laughs> on my table. There she is. She looks pretty awesome. I like her a lot. <laughs>